Looking for a four bedroom home in Bloomington with a two car garage, large backyard, hardwood floors, finished basement, and so much more? Well, we got you covered. Roll that intro. Hey, this is Mike Ligetti with Mozzie Properties, and today I'm bringing you a video walkthrough tour of 9312 Stevens Avenue South here in Bloomington. It is of the four bedroom house behind me. We're gonna go ahead and check that out, but be sure if you like what you see in the video, check out the description below where I post things like rent price, availability date, and links to that itself. Now, without further ado, let's get this show on the road. So, here is the property. Nice, cute home in Bloomington. Got a two car detached garage. Do a quick little overview of the neighborhood. Cold, windy day today, but see a nice single family neighborhood. House is nearby. Here's the drive that leads up to the garage. Got a two car detached garage. Nice little side patio. And a walkway that leads up here to the front door. Now let's go on in and check out 9312. All right, so, feels good to be inside. You can see we come right in here to the fan room area. Nice back of the fireplace. Windows that look out, hardwood floors. I'll give you multiple angles here of everything. And this living room area flows back here into the kitchen dining. So here's your dining room. That goes down to the kitchen. So you got your dishwasher. Gas stove. Built in microwave. Big huge fridge, extra cabinetry and prep space. And I like this nice little dining eat-in nook. Window looks out to the back of the home. And we won't, we'll head out here at the end, but door leads right out to the side patio. All right, um, let's go, let's go upstairs first actually. So we're gonna head over this way, right in from the front. There is a door that gets you to the upstairs. So it's all carpeted up here. And then coming up, we got two bedrooms. Here's the first one. Excuse me. So you got a good size room. You do have a vault to the ceiling line, which is quite nice. Ceiling fan with some overhead lights. Double door closet right here. And then there is a bathroom upstairs too. She got a little medicine cabinet, toilet, sink vanity. And then you've got your shower right back in here. And then over here is another one of the bedrooms. They're using it right now as an office. But again, gives you an idea. Good size room, you get some nice wood paneling for a little contrast. Another dull door closet. You can see it kind of indents back in a little bit over here too. So that's the upstairs. The main level has another two bedrooms and another bathroom. And the downstairs is also finished, so still plenty more to check out. Heading down this way, right here, little linen closet slash coat closet. And then over here, just kind of break it up, we have bedroom, linen closet, bedroom, bathroom. So let's just jump right into this bedroom. This is another good size room.
I'm gonna close it over here. Just trying to show multiple angles. Right here, but in closet. Here's your next bedroom. And it's the little things, but both these have overhead ceiling fans, so nice there too. Just to kind of give you an idea. Closet, some built-in shelving and such. And then here's the bathroom. So you've got your or your toilet, sink mirror, large tub shower back in here. Got some nice tile surround going on. So very nice. And then the downstairs is also finished. So it kind of splits both ways when you come down. Here is the large finished area. Works really well for what they have set up. You know, large sectional, TV. You can kind of do whatever you want down here too. Nice modern paint themes, white trim, gray paint. Right here. Just a well room, so they're kind of using this some extra storage. Then you do have a finished side over here. I really think this part uh, works really well for another in-home office area. Obviously, they got some drums, so works well for that too. But let's get one more side angle here. And then back this way, we got the storage mechanicals. You've got your furnace, AC, water heater, nice washer and dryer. And then some additional room here for storage. Always nice, you can never have too much storage. So that's the downstairs. Now we're gonna go take the outside real quick. Just gotta grab my shoes. So again, maybe not when it's this cold, but in the summer, pretty nice to be able to come out and have this side patio right here. Throw a grill. Enjoy. You got your two-car garage. Do have a little side door right here too. And then the backyard. You got your AC. It is partially fenced. It's not fully fenced. Like you see, it's not connected there, but it is partially fenced. So nice for families. This little fire pit right here. And goes back around. Little area for a garden. Yeah. Very nice yard. All right, well that concludes the tour of this property. If you have any questions, be sure to let me know. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye now. Thanks for watching our video tour. If you're interested in applying for the property, check out the video up here to see how to do our online rental application process. If it wasn't quite what you were looking for, you can browse our other active listings over here as well to see what else we have on the market. Otherwise, be sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified with any new content. Thanks so much and have a great day.